Yo, guys, what is up? It's Teach here coming at you again with another video over on Pal World. And I wanted to show you the best thing that you can feed your pals in the game when it comes to both giving them a large amount of food as well as keeping their sand up, which is important to do if you're trying to prevent them from doing what you can see in my upper right corner where all your pals are either depressed, injured, all of those kinds of things. Having an increased sand will help with that. Now, if you just let them automatically push things into this, you're going to see baked berries with one sand. You're going to see just raw ingredients, which provide zero. However, there is a little bit of a secret trick that you can use in order to produce a ridiculous amount of food and sand insanely cheaply. Now, all you have to do is go over to this right here, and it's pretty much an automatic gathering method because you just have your far Tames farm two things, and then you pull it into this, and that is salad. Now salad is incredibly cheap it's got you can see one salad per two uh, lettuce and two tomatoes and uh, you can produce it really fast i'm not even focusing on producing it right now but i could easily put my uh my pals to work on that and that would be what they worked on but the reason that it's so nice and you should i mean you can literally get thousands of this incredibly quickly i started less than I mean, I tried this base with different things, but this is, seems to work the best on my other bases. Salad gives you a nutrition value of 84 and 11 sand per salad, which is way more food and 11 times the sand of just baked berries. Now, yes, it will require a tame to actually cook it, but because you can gather such a ridiculous amount of it, if I was to remove my berry plots as well as anything else and just put two or three of these guys down, I'm going to get such an insane amount of salad and tomatoes, probably thousands per day, that you can just automatically run through and give your creatures everything they need. But here's the next awesome thing about salad. If you haven't figured it out as well, look at the actual underneath writing on it. Salad is made by mixing lettuce and tomato, but also eating it slightly improves work speed for a period of time. So one, it's insanely easy to make. Two, it's actually nutritious. Three, it gives sand. And four, it also gives a work speed boost, which is an incredibly powerful thing that you should be using inside of your base. Plopping that thing down will cause your creatures to actually get an insane buff from both work speed, sand, and everything else. And it's going to help you prevent them from having the issue that I'm currently having in this base where they're depressed because you don't want that. They slow everything down and it causes bigger problems inside of your base. And then it prevents you from having your factory lines working as quickly as you would like them to. So you should for sure use this trick because it's a very valuable thing to be able to do. And uh, yeah, and if anything else, I mean, again, I, I don't know if you've heard this from me or not, but if you're playing solo player, it's a lot harder to progress in this game. If you look below, you can click on my link for G Portal 10% off. It's like $4 a month and you can rent your own server and everything moves so much quicker and it just seems to run a lot smoother. So anyways, hopefully this video helps you out. And other than that, teach.